My symptoms were extreme fatigue for several years. Um, afternoons about one o'clock it seemed that if I was working at the time I would be utterly exhausted. I would need to lay down on the couch if I was at home. Um, I pretty much wasn't available as a wife, as a mother. I just didn't, I didn't have the energy or the drive and you know I was told that it was depression and was put on antidepressants and still there wasn't any significant change. The CPAP machine was horrible <laughs> in one word. I, um, I couldn't tolerate it. I tried the, the full face deal and then I did the nose pillow and I, I felt better with the nose pillow but then you have to keep your mouth closed and if you open your mouth you've got the air coming out your mouth. I had seen neurologists, endocrinologists, rheumatologists, general practitioners, gynecologists, psychologists, <laughs> um, and ear, uh, ear, nose, and throat. And then finally when I saw Dr. Yu, he said, let's send you to Dr. Shirazi. Um, I had had a sleep study done right before I had seen Dr. Yu, which showed the sleep apnea, which I really honestly, when I had the sleep study done, I didn't think I had sleep apnea. I thought, oh, this is just one more thing. <laughs> I have energy now. I don't feel like I need to lay down at one o'clock and go to sleep. I don't live with the frustration of not knowing what's wrong with me um, and the worries of why am I so tired. It's It's been huge. It's affected uh, the quality of life I have with my family. I have more energy to do things with my kids. I'm not, you know, I'm more available for my husband. I'm just, I'm not always so exhausted. And I'm, it frustrates me that I didn't have these answers years ago. <laughs> my mother told me that the most important thing in your life is your health. And I remember her telling me that when I was younger and I thought, oh yeah, right, mama, okay, whatever. You know, you need, everyone needs money and I so understand it now. It's huge because it would have saved me, I know, thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars if I would have had that sleep study done years ago. And don't give up and don't go, well, you're, you know, well, you need to lose weight or, oh, you have too much stress in your life or you're depressed or, you know, you have too many kids or don't accept it. Do a sleep study. <laughs> <laughs>